What is up guys, today we're checking out the Ibanez Tube Screamer TS9. Guys, yes, something that you, some of you probably thought you would never see. Yes, I have a pedal. <laughs> Fuck's sake. As a lot of you know, if you're like OGs on my channel, I don't really use pedals. Uh, me, reason being, I've never really had to because with all my Blackstar products, I just can kind of get the sound I want without any pedals. But um, I've always been a fan of the Tube Screamers. I've had the Tube Screamer Mini like way back when. Uh, which was really cool, but just it just didn't really do anything for me. But as of late, I'm kind of changing things up a little bit. And uh, a little while back, I purchased the TS9. And, um, you know, it's iconic. I think, like, Hetfield used one of these back in the day. Um, we all know what it is. If you don't know what it is, it is an overdrive pedal. It's like legendary overdrive pedal. What does it do? It just tightens things up and chunks things up a little bit. Uh, so I thought with an already chunky as our sound that I have, with a TS9, it's going to be juicy. Um, so I guess, I mean, we're not going to go too much into it. You, you guys know what it is. It just might be fascinating to see me with a pedal. And I think I am going to be having it in my setup from now on. I've been using it a lot for the last few days. And uh, it's cool. I enjoy it. It's new. It's something different. I can never have a whole set of pedals on a pedal board because fuck me. Can't do all that tap dancing bullshit. I just can't. It's just not It's just not me. You know, you see some people with massive pedal boards with like 700 pedals on there. It's just can't do it. Man. Can't fucking do it, man. Um, but yeah, so we're going into the series one through the Overdrive one channel. Uh, and we're going to stick the, the tube screamer on and um, just see, see what it sounds like. Play around with some tones. So, uh, fuck this box. Okay. <laughs> fuck. Let's get started. So, this is guitar into the amp without the pedal. I mean, uh, you can probably hear the noticeable difference there. As soon as that pedal goes on, just the the chunk. I mean, pfft. oh, I mean, oh. <laughs> Thank you. 
I mean, you can just hear how it just tightens it and gives it that little extra bit of sauce. Uh, you got a few settings on there. You know, you've got, um, well, fuck, what is it? You've got tone, level, and drive, so you can kind of adjust that. I got the tone all the way down, so I don't really need the tone from that because the tone, but, you know, let's just play around with it anyway. <laughs> I mean, there, it's, 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 that's what it is. It's meat and potatoes, really, which is what I love. My whole setup has always been meat and potatoes, nice and simple. Guitar into the amp, boom, we're done. Uh, and with the kind of tone that I get with my Black Star, this is a Series 1 100 watt head 6L6 loaded beast of doom. Um, it's already a beast of an amp. So with the, with this overdrive, it definitely does just give it a little bit more, a little bit more spunk. It just chunks things up, and uh, I'm looking forward to, to using it more in some videos, so, hey, I got a pedal, I'm now one of you freaks, <laughs> I'm just kidding, nothing wrong with pedals, uh, but guys, there you go, nice and simple, the Ibanez TS9, the man that doesn't use pedals, use the pedal, uh, let me know your thoughts, I love it, uh, if you've got one, let me know, let you know, your, let me know your thoughts on all the, you know, tube screamer lines and all that sort of shit, if you're new, hit that goddamn subscribe button, come hang out, uh, follow me on Instagram, all the cool stuff, guys, and as always, rock out, be awesome, and I will see you in the next video. See ya!